Hi there. In this video tutorial, I want to share with you how to add email templates into the Lenet dashboard. The reason why you would do that is to save time. You could add as many templates as you want, and it's useful for when you're sending emails to your first connections or to others. In order to do so, all you need to do is click on the Lenet extension icon and click on Dashboard. Please note that depending on how many connections you have, it will take a little longer, so just give it a few seconds and the dashboard will appear with all of your options. Once you're there, all you need to do is click on Templates, Emails. Now, as you can see, there's one here that I've added before, and um, I'll show you a few things that you can do. First of all, you can click on Edit, and the first thing that you can see is that there's a title, and Please note that the title is not something that the actual client sees, oh sorry, the recipient sees. It's actually someone, something that describes the template for you when you pick it. This uh, field is actually the uh, subject line of the message. And in here is all of the text. And one uh, extra feature that is quite useful is that you can add actual um, files and attachments. But in this particular case, I'm just going to delete it, and then I'm going to update it. In order to add one, all you need to do is just go through the process. The title is whatever uh, you want to describe it. Uh, test email template, for example. The subject line uh, could be whatever you want it to be. And the message could be also whatever you want it to be, and you have up to 2,000 characters. To personalize it, you can just type in or click on the code. And it, this is what is going to replace the actual person's first name. And there'll be other options coming soon, such as company name or everything else, in order to make the messages even more personal without you actually having to do it. And then from there, you can type in whatever you like. And if you wanted to actually upload or uh, add an attachment, let's say it was a proposal or something that you wanted to do, you can just do so by adding this. After that, you click on Save. And that's it. The actual... Um, a template is there and you can use it whenever you're sending templates. To delete it, all you need to do is click on delete and you're done. Okay, I hope this uh, tutorial has been very helpful. If you have any questions about this or anything else, email us at support at and I'll be happy to answer your questions.